how to create a 3D phone in Adobe Illustrator. Knowing how to create basic 3D is great for presentations and product mockups. Today we'll be creating a phone, but you should be able to apply these techniques to other objects you need to make for your class. First, open Adobe Illustrator and select Letter. Create a rectangle with a gray fill and no stroke. Use the selection tool to select the circles at the corners of your rectangle and curve the edges. Use Ctrl plus C or Ctrl Shift V to paste a copy of the rectangle on top of itself. If you're using a Mac, use Command instead of Control. Change your color to light blue and use the selection tool to resize your screen. Next, let's make a power button. Change your color to dark gray, select the ellipse tool by clicking and holding on the rectangle tool, and click and drag while holding shift to make a perfect circle. Now let's make the speaker. Switch back to the rectangle tool by clicking and holding on the ellipse tool. Make a small rectangle and curve the edges just as we did before. You may need to zoom in. Once you have it just right, place it on the phone. Select the first gray rectangle that you created and choose Effect, 3D, Extrude and Bevel. Change your extrude depth to 25 points and choose Rounded Bevel, then select OK. Next, select your screen, button, and speaker by holding down the Shift key while clicking on each object. Choose Effect, 3D, Rotate. Select OK and adjust the position of your objects so they fit on the phone. Feel free to leave your phone simple and stylistic or add gradients. When you're happy with your work, select File, then Save. If you need help with Adobe Illustrator or any other part of the Creative Cloud, feel free to contact me, Willie Schaefer, UTSA Creative Cloud Support Specialist. You can email me at william.schaefer at utsa.edu.